We often get asked about the different controls on a spray gun. Which ones are the more important ones? Which ones are the ones that they should be using in a normal painting paint job? The three controls that we're going to talk about primarily are going to be the uh, fan control, or the, which should be called actually the round flat control. Because with the round flat control, this one changes the fan from being a vertical fan, which is rectangular, and if you turn that all the way back, it's going to give you a round spray fan. Somewhere in the middle, you're going to get various shapes of a football that will not uh, be very good for using for blending base coat or doing small spot repairs. The other controls that we're going to use and the one that's more important is going to be your fluid control knob. That fluid control knob is the one that adjusts your needle and it adjusts your needle to create a trigger stop so that each time I pull the trigger I get the same amount of fluid coming out. Each time we turn that down your fan which is a vertical fan is going to go from uh, tall. It just continually gets smaller but it keeps its fan shape. That fan control or flat round spray control you can adjust just slightly to give you if you have a loose edge on the paint it, you can uh, lose that loose edge give you a nice clean edge. The last control is the air micrometer. The air micrometer in this case is used together with a digital gauge so we start with that as close to full open as possible so that you set your airline at the wall uh, close to the uh, operating pressure that you need at your spray gun and make fine adjustments with that. We also have the option of changing that out and putting a digital gauge into a dock at the rear of the gun and that dock has adjustment wings on it for adjusting your air pressure. But now the nice part about this version I can take any of our SADA standard spray guns and I can add a dock to it so that I can put an air micrometer on the back of a mini jet or onto a primer gun and have full function and full adjustment. Those three controls are the main ones. Air micrometer again for your air, adjusting your air pressure. The fan control should be used less and used only for making small micro adjustments. And most of your adjustments are gonna be done for your fan size with your fluid control knob, which controls the amount of paint and controls the size of your fan. For more information about how to properly use these controls, make sure that you check out all of our videos at our YouTube channel. So go to YouTube, search on SADA by Dan M, and in there there's hundreds of videos that show you proper use and all of the different controls are explained on there as well.